Have you ever wondered, what does a sterile processing technician do? Well, we all know about surgery from watching TV. If you've ever watched an episode of Grey's Anatomy, you often see surgeons doing life-saving work as they perform surgeries on patients. And surgery is performed successfully when it is done by using clean and sterile surgical instrumentation. But what happens to those beautiful surgical instruments after they've been used in surgery and now covered in blood, bacteria, and possibly viruses? It's a biohazard. So surgical instruments are expensive and can't be thrown away after each use. They need to be cleaned and sterilized, but how? That's where professionals known as sterile processing technicians save the day. You might ask yourself, how are sterile processing technicians trained? Well, there are multiple ways. Either you can attend a school or a university where you can learn all the basics of sterile processing, or some hospitals still provide the option to hire without experience and train you on the job. Now, as we talked about earlier, those instruments carry a lot of different organisms and viruses that can be dangerous to patients as well as sterile processing technicians. And that's why personal protective equipment, or PPE, is so important. When in the decontamination area, you must wear a liquid-proof gown, a bonnet or a hat to cover your hair, some eye protection, whether glasses or using an entire face shield, a surgical mask for respiratory protection, and heavy-duty liquid-proof gloves. The decontamination area is usually pretty chaotic with a lot of stuff going on, but this is the place where instruments are received, cleaned, and disinfected, making them safe to handle without protective gear. After decontamination, instruments are inspected for functionality, cleanliness, and assembled in trays or containers according to their specified count sheets. Depending on the department you work for, you might split duties like an assembly line where you assemble a tray and another tech packages, or you might assemble and package your own trays. As those trays build up, it comes time to build a sterilizer load with all the trays on appropriate sterilizer carts or shelves. Ensuring proper placement and detailed load stickers is incredibly important to track sterilization data keeping patients safe. Sterilizers come in many different forms, whether it is a chemical-based sterilant or the most common, which is pressurized steam. Once instruments have cooled, they are moved into sterile storage area where there's little foot traffic and they are protected until next use. And eventually that tray will be selected for its next surgery and placed on a case cart to ride the surgery and SPD cycle life once more. There are many more important duties sterile processing technicians perform every single day that we did not mention in this video. Sterile processing technicians perform critical work for patient safety and many tasks they perform are paramount for the entire cleaning and sterilization process to work effectively. One thing we can say for sure though is that sterile processing techs are awesome. Thank you.